slow down, be creative and enjoy winter. January is a bit of a strange month. The holiday season has passed and outside nature is fast asleep and waiting for spring. The weather can be cold, wet and grey. Instead of living in the moment, we want spring to come fast. We should not be sad it's winter. We have to live in the moment and take advantage of this cold period to charge our batteries. Just slow down and enjoy winter's characteristics. This exciting winter module will focus on these characteristics and how they can inspire us to make exciting Ikebana arrangements. The leafless trees show their branches and we can enjoy the beautiful curves and lines. But how do you bring the beauty of these lines in your arrangements? That's the topic of the first video. We will arrange with some branches and a couple of flowers while focusing on the design element line. In the second video, we will work with bark. Bark is an underappreciated material when it comes to Ikebana arrangements. Many dead trees are shedding their bark. So winter is a season to work with bark. Working with bark is not easy, but after studying fixation techniques, we focus on using bark surfaces in arrangements. The end and the beginning of the year is also the period for tidying up and finding back long forgotten material. I discovered a lot of wooden sticks in my storage. We will use these to make a structure in which we will put a vase. The inspiration comes from an old Japanese Sohets Ikebana textbook from 1974. And last but not least, if you find no material in the attic and everything in the garden or park is covered in snow, there is one last possibility. Something that's a bit of the beaten track. We can use houseplants to make arrangements. So let's enjoy winter together and make some Ikebana arrangements.